Hello everyone, this is Twalana from Llama Index, and in this video I'm going to be walking through one of the latest features we added to Llama Extract, which allows you to look at citations of structured data that was extracted from quite complex data sources, PDFs, and so on. Not only can we see the citations for why certain fields were extracted, but we can also have a look at the reasoning behind why the model thought this was the right information to extract. So there are two ways you can use Llama Extract. One is through the Llama Cloud UI, which is what I'm going to start off with. And you can also do the whole thing in code, which is what I'm going to end with. So what we're going to be doing in this quick video walkthrough is going to be extracting structured information from this quite complex NVIDIA 10K filing report that has lots of information as well as tables and graphs in this as well. So we'll see how we can make use of Llama Extract to extract the information that we are after. If you want to, you can create an extraction agent within the UI by simply giving it a name. I'm going to call this agent one, for example. And this will allow you to make use of schemas that are already predefined in Llama Cloud. So you can use a custom schema and build it here yourself, or you can use one of the four predefined schemas and 10K is also one of them. But what I want to do is show you how to do all of this in code. So to start off, you need to install Llama Cloud services, which I've already done, and provide your Llama Cloud API key. Again, I've done this. If you want to follow along with this particular demo, which I'm going to link to in the description of the video, we're going to be using the NVIDIA 10K PDF, which is available in one of our repositories. And this next code block here simply downloads that to the Colab environment. Once you have that, we can start. All right, so to start off, we want to initialize Llama Extract. So we're going to import Llama Extract. And then if we initialize it without providing any additional inputs, It'll use a default project. I don't have any other projects, so that's okay. If you want to use a different project in your organization, you simply have to initialize Llama Extract with the project ID. Uh, all right, I have that. Next, we can start defining the structure with which we want to extract information. For this, you can make use of Pydantic, which is what I did, and I've defined a Pydantic model called Financial Report. Financial report has a bunch of things. So we want to extract the company name, the description of the report, the filing type, which is one of these four filing types I've defined in the filing type class, um, fiscal year, unit, revenue, and so on. The other thing I want to point out here that every single field we have has a description, which is going to be super useful for the agent because the underlying large language model of that agent is going to be using these descriptions as extra context while deciding what kind of information it's looking to extract. So we've defined that. And then before we create our agent, we want to do one last thing, which is to define the configuration of the agent that we're going to be eventually creating. What we're doing here is basically telling Llama Cloud that we want to be using citations and we want to be using reasoning, and we're also setting extraction mode to multimodal. And once I have that, I can start by creating my agent finally. And to do that, I'm going to be saying Llama Extract, create agents. And then we can provide us a name and let's call it filing agent. Let's provide it with our config. And then let's also provide it with our financial reports as our data schema. Okay, so once that's created, you can actually flip back to Llama Cloud and you'll see that we now have a new extraction agent called filing agent. Great, now we can use that agent. All right, so we had already downloaded the PDF document to the Colab environment. So I'm just going to be saying filing info agent.extract and provide the PDF file. So once we start this, you can also, again, flip back to Llama Cloud and 
have a look at extraction results. Uh, you'll notice that the, you now have a new extraction job, which is in progress. Once it's done, we can start having a look at the extraction results. So we can have a look at filing info data, and this is going to give us all of the fields that we asked for. On top of all of these specific fields we've extracted, because we enable citations and reasoning, we can also have a look at them by saying filing info dot extraction metadata. And this is going to give us the exact reasoning and specific citations for that uh, extraction for all of the fields we extracted. So we start with company name. So this is basically telling us that the company name was extracted as NVIDIA Corporation because it's verbatim in text and is also giving us the citations of exactly where NVIDIA Corporation has been matched. Um, if we go down, we can also see that we're, we've got uh, matching text for fiscal year 2025 and exactly which pages fiscal year 2025 was mentioned and so on. So citations and reasoning is a great fit way for us to verify that the information that we've extracted is accurate. If you do want to give this a go, I'm going to be linking the example notebook in the description. Please let us know what you think. And to get started, you can sign up to Llama Cloud and start creating your own extraction agents.